Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to be talking about that smaller YouTubers deserve some credit. And what I mean by that is, on this platform, YouTube, of course, there are some YouTubers who don't have a whole lot of subscribers, who don't get recognized for their amazing talents. Like, there are some smaller YouTubers who have, like, 100 subscribers or 500, but not as much as a million. I mean like those very small YouTubers who who have amazing talents such as drawing, animations, stand-up comedy, or even gaming. Some people are really good at gaming even though it's just a, some people, um, some people call it a hobby or whatever, but a lot of people like to do that for fun and show the world what they're made of. But I wish they can get the recognition they deserve. But me? I don't know if I want that much recognition because once you gain a lot of subscribers, there's um, a lot of downgrade, not downgrades or something. Whenever you gain a lot of subscribers, I guess you could, I guess I could say downgrades when you gain subscribers is that some people are prone to getting stalkers or being at risk of you know getting canceled if you make like one mistake or more then you're at risk of your channel being completely terminated and even if you try to make another account youtube will automatically just <coughs> delete you back delete you down again and that's one of the things i'm kind of scared about i mean i shouldn't be too scared about it because i know how to be careful on this channel because I actually look back on my videos and making sure I don't say anything offensive or anything like that. Before, I think before uploading my videos or after, I don't know. I don't watch my videos that much, but I can, but I know I try my best not to be offensive. And all those smaller YouTubers, I'm going to give some of them that I've seen, I'm going to give some of them a shout out in the description if you guys want to check out their channels give them maybe a subscribe or hit the notification bell that would I'm sure that would really appreciate them after all the hard work they've been doing just so they can make you know a lot of people entertained I salute you guys by the way smaller youtubers even if if you're if you're if your youtuber name isn't on the description I'm gonna give you a shout out because like I'm like what I'm like one of those guys in the movies like you get a shout out or you get a shout out all of you get a shout out stuff like that if I don't if I again if if I don't put your name on there shout out to you by the way you deserve every recognition for your talent or whatever talent you do as long if as long as you don't bully anybody or make any offensive you know, remarks. I don't know. As long as you don't do anything bad on the platform, kudos to you. Because there's some, there's some people who like to have, I don't know if I should say God complex, because some people like to take their job on YouTube really seriously and think they're better than everybody else. And I don't want any of the smaller YouTubers who get a shout out thinking that, oh, I'm better than everyone else because I got a shout out from this person. No, you're not better than everyone else. Everyone is trying so hard to ma somehow make their channel like a job, like a hobby slash job. There are some people out there who are too scared to get an actual job in real life. Maybe because they have social anxiety or something, or something and they think that YouTube is better for them and they think it supports their, themselves a lot better, and that's completely fine. If you wanna do YouTube for a job because you think it supports you and you're too scared to actually um, actually have a job in real life, I'm, that, that's completely fine. You do you, as long as you don't you know offend anybody, like I said before. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz, and shout outs by the way. Um, peace.